Thank you for tuning in to this uh, episode of Warm Wrong Art. And do you guys miss comic book conventions? If so, this video is for you. So this video is about a, a convention that I went to last year, 2019, not this year. As of me uploading this video, it's uh, April of 2020, and there's a Corona night pandemic. So the, all events and comic book convention has been canceled. But um, a lot of times, uh, some of the conventions I'll go to, I'll record live videos where I'm walking around with my video camera and I'm just talking to creators and everyone in comic book conventions. This is one of them. So this was recorded last year. Uh, so here's one of the convention banners that I've done. You know, these are my convention banners. And for 2020, I, ha I got this new thing. It's this uh, convention um, table cloth banner, which sadly, for 2020, there's no comic book conventions that I don't think that I'll be attending. Maybe if things get better towards the end of the year, maybe I'll uh, debut this. But I want you guys to see how this looks. It has my website, so that's, that's pretty cool. So, uh, this is a nice video. There's a lot of comic book uh, creators that's in there. I'll, I'll speak to them. I'll talk to a lot of people in Artist Alley and also uh, different booths. And then you can uh, check out uh, some of the websites and social media that they, that they talked about. Even Rob Liefeld, I got a chance to talk to him. He's the guy who created Deadpool. So uh, watch the whole video till the end. It's uh, gonna be a fun video. So if you miss comic book conventions, this will be a fun video for you. So uh, let's check it out. Okay, I'm in Wizard World Bay Area Comic Con, and once you walk in, who it's do you party. see? It's a party. Oh my goodness, I'm on someone's camera. Hey, I never man. look better. It's Wizard World, Open Convention Center, and I'm with my very, very close friend. Walden. Walden. And when, once you walk into the convention, the first person you're greeted by is... Kato Kaelin, I'm glad to be here. And Walden's daughter may serenade you with a song later. Yes. She's that good. Okay. She's that good. Cool. And Walden, let's meet some more people. Hey, you guys, guess what? You're on camera. Get over here. Wave. Show off your shirts. They're matching. Yes. Awesome. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Thank you. Bye, buddy. Bye, buddy. Okay, so I'm gonna flash. I'm gonna show you around uh, this convention. So this Walden is the first Walden, convention. <laughs> so this is the first convention for Wizard World in the Bay Area. And today's Saturday. I was here Friday. Friday is a little bit slow. So if you're thinking about coming to this convention, uh, check this out. Uh, so here I'm gonna comb through the booth so you can see the size of the convention and check out how it is. So with a lot of conventions, they have this wild bill booth. Hello, how are you? And let's see what else they have here. Hello, this is T-Mobile. T-Mobile right over here. T-Mobile. Wizard. Wizard. How's the show for you so far? Uh, it's going great. What are you guys selling? Uh, well, we are offering some of the charging accessories yeah. and some great promos that we have for the holiday season. Oh, cool. Yeah, such as cool. some free tablets, some discounts on Apple Watches, and yeah. the newest Apple products like the Apple Pro, AirPods Pro. Excuse oh, me. very cool. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, Thank have you. Fun. Have a good day. <laughs> so, so that was the commercial ad. <laughs> and let's look at let's look to see what's over here. Here's I, I don't know what this area is. I, I, it looks like it's a cosplay area. So let's take a look. Not a lot of people in this area. Hello. How are you? Good. You are. I'm Dark Supergirl. Dark Supergirl. Yes. yes. And then you changing clothes on uh, different days? Yes, every day is something different. Okay. Yeah. What's your name? You want to promote yourself? Oh, sure. I'm Sparkle Stash. Like a mustache. Like a mustache? Yeah. And they can find you all in different social yes. media with Sparkle all Stash. All the social medias. Awesome. Twitch. Okay. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. thank you. Okay. Now, let's see what else they have here. Um, uh, there's more cosplay. Here. We'll, I'll show you what they have. I don't think they're here yet because right now it's 10 o'clock and it's pretty early. Okay, let's see. Oh, okay. So here is Captain Casey Cosplay. Okay, tell me about yourself. How Hello. Are you this? Hi, uh, I'm Casey. I've been doing this for, gosh, 2011 was when I first started cosplay. 2011? Yeah. Oh, so that's so. been a while. Yeah. So you're Superman today. What are you going to be uh, other days? Um, Supergirl today and then... Supergirl, I'm sorry. You're all good. Yeah. Um, and then tomorrow I'm going to be from a book series uh, called The Throne of Glass series. Her name's Manon and she's really cool and a witch and everything. So I'll be like witchy tomorrow. Oh cool. And you want to plug yourself on social media? Yeah. So all under Captain Casey Cosplay. All thing, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Okay, great. Thank you. Yep. Thank, thank you. you. 
Let me see who else is here. There, this one is McThor. Here, this. Here's McThor. It's Captain America. No, I'm sorry. The Thor with Ronald McDonald. And let's see. And I don't know what all that is. Let's see what else they have here. Right over here, Wizard World Comic Con. Just the way it is, I guess. All right, cool. Okay, there we go. And then here's some more cosplay people. Let's let's check them out. Some helmets over here. Very cool helmets. Hello, how are you? Uh, lights, lightsaber team. And here are here are some uh, art. And then here's some ten ton press. Ten ton press over here. Let's look at some of the wares. And then we have a T-shirt for some clothing vendor here. And then here's mystery grab bag. Is this all you right here? So this convention in 2019 is in November 23rd. Wizard World Bay Area. The Argo Wizard World Bay Area. They have an open play lounge. Where people can play games here and they can win awards. Here are some of the awards. Hello, how are you? Tell me about some of the awards. Oh yeah, uh, so they go to our, all of our events that we have. We have uh, about four events going on this afternoon. Okay. Actually, we have one tomorrow at Mario Kart. Um, but first place gets each uh, of these trophies. Uh, the events are free and honestly... Uh, do they have that at every Wizard World? Uh, yeah, actually we're at every Wizard World event and we do first place uh, trophies to every single event. Oh, very cool. Thank you. Yeah, Thank absolutely. You. Thank you. And look at all the systems they have all set up. It's all empty now, so if you're coming in, <laughs> it's a good time. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. And then here's, let's look at this booth. There's a necklace and stuff here. Let's see what else they have. Let's continue walking. Uh, retailers. Retailers here. Uh, this is impressive, all of these things. Yeah, let's look over here. We're on aisle, so there's 1,000 aisles. Lazy Bone Studios over here. Okay, we're gonna walk through the next aisle so you can see the rest. And then on the back, the see right over here. Oh, there's here's a McDoor right over here. Very cool. Okay, and then now we have this booth. This is the convention swag that you can get over here. Convention swag. And some, some more stuff. I like the long flowing hair. Yeah. I'm gonna walk through this convention pretty quickly so you can see what's here. So if you're thinking about exhibiting in Wizard World, this is uh, in Wizard World Bay Area, this is what you can see. And then we have some actors. Here are some of the actors that are here. So we have Barry Williams over here. Hi Barry, how are you? Hi. And then we have Claudia Wells over here. Oh, she's not here, I'm sorry. And then there's Sam Jones. I remember when I got back to LA. Matt Ryan. Neil McDonald. Katrina Law. Turn this off first. We have this person. Here. What a fun. Brandon Roth. This is a line for Brandon Roth already. Oh, there's like three. Okay. And then just right here, I'm going to walk around. Right when you walk in, they have this. Panel. They're going to do a karaoke here. 
Hey, Walden Wall, if you know me, I want to get a picture of someone from Italy all the way to the from show. From Italy? You're on a camera right now. This is going all over the world. Right now, my friend, bring in your lovely daughter from Luigi. This is all my friends from Italy, my friends from Indonesia, and say your name. Mauro. Did you hear that, folks? Mauro. Say your name. Mauro. Not yours yet, her. <laughs> oh, yeah. Gee, he gets all the lines. <laughs> Leaky, leaky. <laughs> yeah, and? Terry. And Terry, who's the other woman that's over there, not on camera? And together, for Walden, we are going to order one big pizza pie. Everybody gets to have their own topping on it. I start with you, Marino. What's your topping and say it loud? On your pizza, what would you like on it? You, uh, like a pepperoni. A uh, pomodori. Pepperoni. Pepperoni. Pepperoni, you don't eat meat. No, 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 no. you know it's pepperoni in Italian? No. It's a bell pepper. Uh. So never ask an Italian uh, when they go to eat pizza with pepperoni. It's going to bring you pizza <laughs> with a bell pepper. Ay, ay, ay. Did you guys hear that? If you order in Italy, come over here. Come over here. I'll tell you a story. If you order pizza in Italy with pepperoni, guess what you get? Come here. Guess what you get? You get a pizza with a pepper on it. And you order something out of pizza. What do you want? Hershey chocolate. Hershey chocolate! <laughs> <laughs> you just this the girl for you. She loves Hershey chocolate. Thank you all. Thank you. And that's the awesome Kato Kato. Okay, okay so then here's his blood pictures. And there's going to be close up. Very much down. Chris is back. He brought a close She's not doing good. Okay, we're gonna head on over to the artist alley here. So let's check out the artist alley. Okay, so you've never seen it before, never played it. Okay. And he's holding out a lot of, uh, lot of nice prints over here. The A's, the sweatshirt, the chrome, metal prints, electric designs over here. Hello, how are you? A jewelry, jewelry. And then there's this one, it looks like some kind of optical thing. Hello, how are you? Hi, boss, how's it going? Tell me about uh, this. This is Hi. pretty awesome. Hi, I'm Jay John, the actor. Okay. This is Jamie Foxx's pre Bay Revolt. This is his oh. uh, eyewear line he launched two years ago. Oh, very? Past September. Oh, there's Jamie right over there. There he is. Over there. And uh, how, two years ago? Yes, sir, two yeah, years ago. And, and then you guys drive around to different conventions? We drive around all around the nation. We actually just did the uh, the Wizard World back in Chicago. Yeah. What was it, two months ago? Yeah. So uh, we did that. We went to Oakland. We just did uh, Aftershock here in Sacramento. Yeah. It was about a month ago. And now we're back again, back you, in the Bay Area. I mean, so the classes, they're everywhere? Or you only, it's only exclusive well, we, to conventions? Uh, we sell, this is our only store. We have no brick and mortar. Oh, uh, very everything cool. is done online, QVC, home shopping network type thing. Okay. Um, you can find us at www.prevayrevolt.com uh, you can do all your uh, measurements for your eyes there they have the full full-on spectrum for uh, eyewear from shades to uh, actual readers and also uh, prescriptions for your own uh, prescription eyes oh cool so she got all the nice glasses so people can actually come in here and get uh, sizey for the glasses. Well, not here. The optometrist is not here today. Yeah. Sometimes we have them on site, but uh, mainly you buy the shades. You can buy them here, try them on here, then take them and um, go online to prefavorable.com and okay. put in your measurements for your eyes. Everyone. Oh, very different. cool. Yeah, cool. and they send it once made specifically yeah. for you to you. Oh, very nice. That's very nice. Thank you. Thank you. That's very Thank nice. You. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So let's check out more of the glasses over here. Okay, and let's look at the rest of the convention. And here, I think this is a panel area. Panel area right here. Let's check that out, some seats. Okay, and then let's look at the other side. The other side is right over here. 
here's my friend Michael. Hey, hey Michael. Look at Michael's. Look How's it at going? All of Michael's awesome stuff. Look at that. He has metal prints. These are very impressive metal prints. My neighbor Totoro. Okay. The, the Avengers over here, and then Star Wars, Star Trek, Harry Potter. We got uh, David Bowie. Very cool. How long have you, you been doing this? Ooh. I can see. Uh, well, I've been doing it with with the Rushmores and everything for about six years, but six years before that, I, I did did it way back in the day. Yeah, when no when there wasn't that many fans at conventions. Yeah. I like your booth; <laughs> it's pretty big. I think yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a little monstrous. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> cool. You have a website? You want yeah, to you know, well, I have my my uh, Instagram handle on the banner. Okay. With my uh, artwork from Fathom. Uh, so right over here. Check out Michael's uh, Instagram page. Great, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. They're a little smaller company than they used to be. There's more. Here's uh, Kinetic. We met Kinetic before. Hello, how are you? Hey, what's up, Walton? Good, good. Uh, how's everything? Oh, doing fantastic. We're but doing a Kickstarter right now, right? I am doing yeah. a Kickstarter, yes, sir. We yeah. want to take these eight books, put them all into one pile trade paperback. Okay. And then, uh, what dates are the Kickstarter? Uh, the it's live now, and it goes on through December sixteenth. Okay, December sixteenth. Awesome. And what, how do they find it? Uh, you can find it at uh, www.kineticcomic.com. Awesome. Great. Thank you. Cool. Thank, Thank you. you all. Thank you. And we have sketch tunes over here. Sketch tunes. Yeah. So. Yeah, but yeah, we California film. Festival. Look, look at that, all that nice equipment. Okay, and then we have more t-shirts. That's, that, that's a nice Punisher shirt over there. Christina for Square. Hello, how are you? And then more prints. Having these prints over here. Hello, how are you? How are you guys? Hello, how are you? Hey. Oh, you're the 13-year-old? Uh, 12. 12-year-old? Yeah. Yeah, I saw you on the... Awesome, nice to meet you. I saw you on the front page of the Wizard. Thing. Yeah. Yeah, awesome. These are your work? Yeah. How long have you been doing this for? I can't remember when I started. Yeah? What's yeah, your name? So What's your name? Chisano. Chisano, that's your... Uh, you have social yeah. media? Yeah, my Instagram is DeploArt. DeploArt, okay. And my email is detonna.topala at gmail.com. This, this is very cool, having a young artist like this is showing their work at a convention. Very cool. Thank uh, you. Good luck, good luck. Thank you. Thank you. And here's more here. The artist is not here. This is, looks like they're selling custom stickers. Hello, how are you? Okay. And then there's rings over here. Pinups. We're almost to the rest of the convention. Let me walk through this quickly. We have this one, Matthew Wolf. Hello, Matthew. Hi, how are you? Nice food. And then we have Bri Brittany Paul Inc. Okay, look at the work. Very nice work. Thank you. This one. Uh, it looks like a four, just four hours. Yeah, this one. Little restaurant. And it, it, as teenagers, I, I think a lot of people relate to that because as teenagers, teenagers have a lot of angst. And so when you see your heroes displaying a lot of angst, it's very appealing. Now I think. Okay. Let's see what else we have over here. Like festivals and stuff, you know. Yeah. I'm walking through it quickly because I want to get back to my booth as quick as I can. We're over here. Hello. Hi. Hello. And there's Mog. Mog's all the way from oh, Hawaii. Hey. How are you? Doing great. Good. How's it going, man? Good, good, good. Good to yeah. see you again. Yeah. I've met Mog in Hawaii maybe a year ago, over a year yeah. ago. Yeah. yeah. It's about a year. You're doing good now. You're not. You're doing freelance work now. Yes, freelance yeah. work. Yeah. Very nice. And then uh, some. There's some of her work. And plug yourself, social media. Oh, um, Mog Park at Yahoo. I'm uh, not Yahoo. Sorry, Mog Park at Instagram. Instagram. How about uh, Facebook? Yeah, and Facebook, same thing. Mog Park, Everything Facebook, okay. Instagram. Very cool. Yes. It's good to see you again. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Here's Ben Russell. See, right over there. Hey, ben. Hey, ben. How's it going? Good, good. Here, look at some of Ben's work. And your social media is benrussell.art on ben Instagram. Russell. Yeah, with one L only. Just one L. <laughs> with one L. One L. Okay, cool. And then we have the art of everything. This is Jimmy Tran. Hey Jimmy, how are you? How are you? This is your work? 
Yeah, this is. Um, you feel free to thumb oh, through. This is very like. nice. Cool. Look at that. Uh, plug yourself on social media. Sure. Uh, hi. My name's Jimmy Tran. Um, I'm an artist, uh, illustrator, work in animation, but I'm out here just trying to do like my own thing and just kind of put some of my art out there. Uh, art ranges from anything from like superheroes to like more fine art stuff. Um, you can find me at uh, jtapp.com or on Instagram at nexorcist, N-E-X-X-O-R-C-I-S-T. Awesome. Thanks. Thank you very much. Okay, here's more art here. Here's like a large print area. Very cool. Ooh, I like this. Oh, it connects together. Yeah, that's very nice. That's very nice. Another one? Look at all these prints. Okay, here's this one. Hello, Hello, how are you? How are you? The House house of Doodle Hoi? House of Doodle Hoi? No, it's the House of HOD. HOD. I, house of HOD. Okay. <laughs> house of oh, HOD. Yeah. Okay, this is your work? This is all me? Oh, very nice. Thank you. Very Thank cool. You. Thank you. And your social media, oh, that, that's your website, yep. right? Yep. House, house, house of Doodle. Doodle. Yeah. And how about social media? Yes. Uh, it's House of Doodle, anything. House of Doodle. Yeah, at House of Doodle. Hashtag House of Doodle. Well, the Spice Bob is a perfect square. Yeah. Great. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna go on with this side. Water, color, chaos. I like all the colors. Thanks, dude. Well, I, I like the colors. Social media? Oh, I like I like your outfit. Thanks, dude. The outfit's awesome. Social media? Uh huh. Plug yourself. Uh, out there. Okay, all of your Craig, Levi Craig's art, Levi Craig 75. Awesome. Great. Thank you. Good luck. Good luck with the show. And then Fer Feral City. Where's Feral City? Oh, right over here. Right over here. This. Hello. Hello. Then we have in minute designs. Very cool. Very cool. I, I gotta run through this quicker. It's. Let's see. Here's ZC Art. Ooh, look at these uh, goggles. Oh, these are nice. Hello, how are you? Hi, doing how good. Are, are these custom made? Yes, the goggles oh, cool. are painted by her, yeah. my wife. The uh, lenses are uh, photoshopped or uh, done on a computer and laser etched later. Oh, very nice. Very cool. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Badass girl saves the world. Girl. Hi, girl. <laughs> you're the artist on this? I am not. I am the brand merchandising person. Okay. Um, my business partner. Chris Everhart is the awkward creator, okay. and um, I am also a writer, but I did not write on this series. I will write on the next four series. Okay, cool. But yes. Cool. Cool. Very nice. We like Badass nice. Girl. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Check out Badass Girl. Do it. <laughs> and then here's um, four color films. Four color films. Our website reviews every comic book movie, and I do original art for every movie. Oh, very cool. This is your art. This is art too? This is me. Oh, this is, uh, this is art too? Yeah. Well, it's like photos. Very nice. Oh, thanks, man. Very cool. Very cool. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. Here's, um... Tell me about this booth. Oh, uh, we are Hero Wears and Supplies. Okay. Oh, for like, uh... Oh. Oh, this is, uh, is this, um... Spirit of uh, um, Majora's Mask from the Legend of okay, Zelda. Okay, okay, okay. I, I don't know. Very cool. I like, I like all the stuff that you have. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Have a good day. And then here's a large print area. Look at these metal prints. This. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate this. What's up? And we have Chibi Town. I think this this person is on the wrong side of the booth. Mm -hmm. How are you? Good. How are you doing? Good. Tell me about yourself. Or promote yourself. Oh, okay. Uh, your Jumbo Studios, and uh, I draw commissions on the spot, and have prints and stickers. So uh, a lot of fan art, a lot of uh, custom work. Awesome, great. And then you have social media that yeah, you like to promote? Yeah, I do. Uh, I should be on Instagram. It's I just have an extra O at the end, so it's Y-O-J-A-M-B-O-O -O okay. at Instagram.com. Awesome, I, I, I like that, Instagram. <laughs> that card holder. That's very cool. Oh, thank you. That's actually from a 3D printer. That isn't me, but oh, very uh, cool. <laughs> still, thank it's you. really pretty. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. you too. We have Art of Lawrence Washington. Oh, this looks like 3D? Yeah, no, man. Look, there's uh, layers in this. 
Yeah. Oh, so these are all handmade. All handmade. Yeah. That takes a lot of a lot of time. A lot of time. A lot, a lot of work. work. Yeah. Look at that. They're nice. A lot of carpal tunnel. A lot of carpal. <laughs> <laughs> Switch to the other hand. <laughs> yeah, I wish I could. So tell me about yourself. Uh, if you have social media, if you like to post. Yeah, uh, I am art uh, underscore by underscore lw art by lw. Um, I've been doing this for about four years. And yeah, just uh, I gotta try to stand out above uh, among yeah. all these talented people around me. You know, that's very nice. I've never seen art like this. I mean, I've seen it online, but I've never seen it in person. It's very right. cool. Also, you draw them too. I draw them and then I cut them and then I, you know, stack them in layers to get that 3D effect. Oh, very. very so cool. each layer will have a different part of the body. So each layer is hand drawn. Mm -hmm. Oh, very cool. Yeah, very nice. So check out Lawrence's work. Thank you, Lawrence. Hey, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> Yeah, we have this booth. Uh, we're gonna go across this side. We'll do this quicker. Okay, let's see. Oh, here is his card. Hey. Thank you. Here we go. Here's Lawrence's card. Check him out. Check out the back of his card. Thanks, Lawrence. All right. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna walk over here. And here's Joe. Hey Joe, how are you? Hello. Tell me about yourself. Uh, plug your social media. Yes, hello, I'm Joe Wos. I am a cartoonist with an internationally syndicated feature called Maze Tunes, which are cartoon illustrated mazes. I also have a series of best-selling maze books, and I'm a maze master. I created the world's largest hand-drawn maze. You can visit me on social media at Maze Tunes, M-A-Z-E-T-O-O-N-S. So awesome. visit me on Twitter, Facebook, everything. Awesome, so all under the same name. All the same name. Very good. Look at, look at some of uh, Joe's work here. Look at that banner, that banner's so awesome. I just want to go there and start drawing, start following all the lines. Yeah. Great, thank you Joe. You're welcome, thank you. thanks. And then here's, uh, not set up yet, uh, here's, uh, here's Lex, he's my booth neighbor. Hey Lex, how are you? Hi. So you tell me about yourself, plug your social media. Uh, my name is Alexis Fajardo. Uh, you can find me online, Twitter and social media. Lex Fajardo Art. Okay. And I do a graphic novel series called Kid Beowulf. It's an action adventure middle grade series inspired by the old story of Beowulf. And uh, in my universe, Beowulf the Viking and Grendel the monster are 12 year old twin brothers. And they travel across Europe and Asia, meeting other heroes, getting into other adventures. And uh, if you're a fan of Bone or Amulet or Avatar The Last Airbender, then you might enjoy Kid Beowulf. Cool. Yeah, so check out uh, Lex's work and then check out his website. Thanks. Your website is uh, kidbeowulf.com. Kidbeowulf Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. And then here's my booth. We'll get to that later. And here's James. Hey, James, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Good to see you again. You too. And here's James' uh, booth. And would you like to plug yourself on social media or uh, website? Sure. Uh, and anyone interested in uh, my artwork can find uh, a bunch of it at www.jamespasco.net. Uh, the last name is spelled P-A-S-C-O-E. P-A-S-C-O-E. So look for James here. Thank you. James and I, we've been booth neighbors once before, <laughs> right, right next door at another convention, That's and then right. we're proof neighbors again. Okay, cool, it's good to have you as a neighbor again. Thanks, Thank you. good to see you. Thank you. Um, here's Ron. Oh, uh, over here. So, so that was not. And then over here. And then we have, right here, we have Rob Liefeld. That's not Rob Liefeld. No, Ron but here's, here's all, all of his work. Is that here yet? And we, here we have. Goalish Bunny Studios. Dana Living Art. You must be Dana. Diana. Diana, I'm sorry. Diana. Diana. Nice to meet you. Oh, you were talking. Here, role playing game. Are you done? Hello. And I'm going to go grab something quickly first. <coughs> you see, so I did a commission and I'm going to give it back to the artist. Well, not the artist, but the person who commissioned. There's a spiral book. Over there. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to. So this is the commission that I've done for one of the collectors. I'm going to give it to him now. He's standing in line for Rob Liefeld, but I'm going to hand it to him and see what he says. So right over here. Check it out. 
And then here he is. I recognize him. Hey, Vic. How's it going? Hey, Gary. How are you? Good. 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 How do you like it? Oh, I think it's awesome. Yeah, I'm yeah. pretty proud of how it turned out. Yeah, it looks great. Thank you for having me do it. Oh, thank you for doing it for yeah. me. It looks great. Great. And then Vic is gonna, we're gonna do an interview together later on. Yeah, so we'll this is Vic. Okay, and this is Gary. Very, Hello. very cool guys. If you go to a lot of conventions, you'll see him. You'll see them. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you guys later. All right, for sure. Okay, and then Kristen Gossett. Hi, Kristen. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Um, could you tell me about yourself and would you like to plug your social media? Uh, what, uh, what is this for again? Oh, for my YouTube channel. Okay, cool. Yeah. I'm Walter Wong, the artist uh, with artists. Hey, how are you? How are you? It's nice to meet we, you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hello. Hi. Hi. My name's so, Ellen. <laughs> so I know your work. Yes. Just for, for the other people that doesn't know your work. Yes. Yeah, tell me about, uh, you started with Red Star. Yes, uh, I'm Christian Gossett. This is my book, The Red Star. Oh, Red Star, that's right. Yep, um, it has been, it was published by Image originally, by uh, the great Jim Valentino. Jim Valentino. <laughs> back in the day, and it was uh, a big hit from the beginning. Had a wonderful time. Uh, our first two issues were uh, among the top five in the nation for reorders. Uh, three Eisner nominations, and uh, it also gave me a wonderful career in concept design and in storyboarding. And so we're back here at, uh, I'm back here at Wizard World, Oakland. Uh, in fact, there's a funny story. The first time I ever pitched the Red Star, it was at WonderCon Oakland, way back in the day. Oh, and, uh, at the same venue, yeah. and uh, the pitch was rejected. Oh no! <laughs> it's okay. It was great. Uh, it made me go back and uh, work on it. Why didn't they get it? Well, it's not the idea. The idea is awesome. Why didn't they get it? Yes. And it uh, helps you explain it in a way that's more clear, which is what we do every day as storytellers. We have to basically say, if it's great in my head. How do I make what's great in my mind great to other people's minds too? And uh, so yeah, Red Star is a story of it's it's a love story. Uh, Maya Antares is a sorceress in a in a fictional uh, parallel universe called the Lands of the Red Star. It looks a lot like our Soviet Union. Uh, she is a sorceress because in their world they have magic. They have military industrial sorcery. Uh, it, the, the relationship in their world to magic is a lot like ours to electricity. We just have it. It's no big deal. And they have it and therefore they codify it. Um, in a world where there's a really authentic take on magic, you would treat magic the same way as we do any other technology, right? Like there are, there are incredibly destructive war technologies. Not everybody gets to use them. Only those who have certain uh, societally uh, societal roles are allowed to use that power and that's the way it is in the lands of the Red Star. So anyway, she's a sorceress, her husband dies in battle, she realizes through a ghost that he didn't die, that he's actually in the afterlife and she goes into the afterlife to rescue him. And what she discovers along the way has to do with the source of the magical power in this world and the source of the magical power in this world is really, really dark and scary and dangerous and she realizes not she's not on an adventure just to rescue her husband, she's also on an adventure to save uh, the entire world. So oh, that's cool. the Red Star. Is this the comic you're also currently working on? Yes, uh, I am. Uh, this is. These are the latest single issues. These are actually kind of older. They're collected into the fourth graphic novel, which we have here uh, today. This is Sword of Lies, the fourth graphic okay. novel. So okay. that's here. Um, this one is really, really special to me because I uh, was able to work with my friends from Weta Workshop in New Zealand. Uh, that's me with my dear friend Richard Taylor, the visual effects supervisor for Lord of the Rings. Oh, very nice. and, uh, and these are my buddies uh, from the design workshop. Uh, Greg Broadmoor's in there, Daniel Falconer, Stephen Crow, Paul Tobin, Chris, uh, Christian Pierce, uh, among others. Oh, some great nice. Ben Wooden, some great fellows in there, all great, great guys. And uh, you know, when you, it, when you fall in love with a movie from New Zealand, you're, look, you're falling in love with the work of these gentlemen here. Oh, very, very nice, very cool. Yeah. Great, thank you. And in social media? Social media, at Gossett underscore pictures is where you want to go. At Gossett underscore pictures at Instagram. Uh, that's me. I'm not on Facebook at the moment. Deactivated, having a great time okay. not being on Facebook. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> great, it's nice to meet you. It's, a pl it's an honor to meet you. Oh, actually. it's wonderful yeah, to meet you. I've followed your work since, since the beginning yes, of this. Yeah, nice to meet yeah. you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. And we have more. Artist here. No. Right. You don't ever use the photo booth. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hey, how are you? This is this is Preston. We did some work together actually on this book. Yeah. Right over here. So yeah. tell me about tell me about yourself and also so, social media. Yeah. Uh, Preston Poulter. 
I've been making stuff. Well, you were you were there at the beginning. What, like three years ago? Right over on this a, one? Yeah, that that's, one. That's me right over there. Yeah. Okay. And and we're on issue four. We're going on issue five to complete the story. It's about the deadliest lady fighter pilot who ever lived. Well, Lily was her aviator call sign. And I'm branching out because not everyone wants a war story. So here's Guinevere and the Divinity Factory. We're about to do issue two on that one. Very cool. It's about a woman who can do magic. We combine elements. That's some of the interior artwork back there of the Great Gatsby and Doctor Strange. Very cool. Very nice. It's good. It's nice to finally meet you. Yes. Thank you. Nice Thank you. Too. Thank you. And then this is Fire Engine Red. Always. On Always red. Bet on red. George, you're George. I'm George. And I'm Walden. Nice to meet you, George. Nice to meet you. How are you? So tell me about you and social media. Sure. So uh, my name is George McHale. I'm a writer from Canada, and my social media is at Comic Book George. At Comic Book George. Good. 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 Yeah. And this is my monster comic. It's called Cover Darkness. It's kind of like Game of Thrones meets the Universal Monsters. It has vampires, werewolves, Frankenstein, the Mummy. And the creature from the Black Lagoon. Oh, oh, nice, nice. It's about this family that gets separated from each other. I oh, know, right? I like, I like how, how that looks. Yeah, it's oh, like yeah. a tower of monsters. Exclusives. Yes. Oh, very nice. Very cool. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Thanks so nice much. Nice to meet you. And here we have jewelry. Jewelry. We're gonna turn around this side. So, so that's all the artists in Artist Alley already. And then now here's booths over here. We're gonna go diagonal this side. So, booth. Uh, retailers, vendors over here. Retail vendors. And then we have these mystery boxes. And then we have this. And then right over here we have here some Pokemon toys. Here. Hey, how are you? It's good to see you. Dude, how you from doing, uh, Wizard World, uh, from Bell County Comic Con, remember? Oh my we were gosh, on the, uh, yeah. On the same airport, uh, on the same ride back to the airport. Come on! Do you guys know Bell this County! Is? Do you guys know who this is? Next year, 2020. It's the 40th anniversary. Flash Gordon Reunion World Tour. See you. Yeah, so good to see you again. I'm so happy it's to good, see you. Good to be seen, man. Yeah. Well, I'll talk to you soon, okay? Take care. Uh, yeah. And then we have some booths over here. And then we have heroic, heroic imaging. That's a nice setup. That's a very nice setup. A B comics. What's he doing here? What's he famous? So more. Let's look at the rest of the vendors, and I, I really got to go back to my booth. See here, so goat, goat metal art. Well, look at this wall prints. Okay, and then we gonna look at Daniel's hands. Ooh, this is a nice piece. All the props. All the very nice props. And they're all for sale. And they're all for sale. How about the Italian dressing? <laughs> That's part of my lunch. <laughs> So, do you have a website that you like to I don't on? sell online. Oh, just on convention circuit. I'm either at conventions or I do one of a kind. Oh, very cool. This yeah. is very nice. Yeah, it fully articulates. The stones are magnetic. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, nice. Very detailed. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. Here. These comic boxes. Oh. Yeah, this is like vinyl decals. Vinyl decals, the soup. How are you? Good, thank you. It, your website's interactive designs? What's this? Oh, you oh, so, I use an app that works with all my artwork. Oh, cool. And all the designs come alive. All, all the t shirts are like that? Mm hmm. Yeah. Show you, sometimes they're more integrated into the design. This is kind of what most of them are. Oh, this is very nice. You create all this? Mm -hmm. Tell me about yourself. Uh, my name is my name's Julian. I make t-shirts, okay. and I started doing um, my background's in animation. Yes. But I got into t-shirts as a hobby. But then when I was doing this as an experiment, I tried it on this Bigfoot. This technology, it's called 
uh, augmented re oops sorry about that so Bigfoot's the, the first one yeah Bigfoot was the first one I kind of just read about the technology yeah and since my background was animation it was easy for me to do the <laughs> you're a busy person yeah, turn off the mic Oh, very nice. That's awesome. So that was, awesome. Yeah, so it was easy for me to make that initial jump. You know, so they, like they just use the, the camera? Yeah, yeah, it recognizes, it's an app. It's an app? Yeah, it's an app. So I use a third party app, I use an app called Artivy right now, okay. I'm working on my own. But there's a lot of different platforms for this technology, right? Okay. So as the technology people fight it out, yeah. I'm just bouncing between people and I'll pick up the yeah. one who was the best. What happens with this one? I'll show you. This so. is uh, it's, uh, it's a uh, it's Yeah, I'm proud of this. It's down. Now it looks like the Sarat. Yeah. Can people buy your Sarat line? Yeah. Oh, tell me about uh, your website. It's, it's cryptidzoo.com. Yeah. You have all, also all the social medias. Yeah, uh, Cryptidzoo yeah. Interactive on Instagram. I'm the most active, and then okay. Cryptidzoo on Facebook. So we have and videos up there as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, awesome. So check out. Oh, what's your name again? Uh, Julian. Check out Julian's work over there. This is this is very impressive. I've never seen anything like this before. Thanks, very man. Very nice. Appreciate Thank you. It. Thank you, Julian. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And then we're gonna. I think we walk. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, let's look at the car. So yeah. So check it out. Right over here. Julian's work. And here's all the social media stuff. Thank you. Thank Thanks, you. Yeah. See ya. And here's uh, Cape Cow. Some, I think these are pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna walk through the rest of the convention. Some comic books over here. Comic books here, action figures, uh, water coolers over there if you're thirsty. And then we have this area. Or, or, let me show you this. Metal prints. This metal prints are so cool. Very cool. Very nice. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Uh, good. What's your name? Howie. Howie. And then do you sell online or anything? Yes, we do. Oh, would you like to plug yourself on, uh, <laughs> online and social media? <laughs> yeah, sure. Um, this is one of uh, six of our artists. We have a studio based in Orange County. Okay. You can find all this and other works at compactstudios.com. Compactstudios.com? That's right. Okay, very cool. How about social media? Is that the website? Compact Studios as well. Okay, awesome. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. And then we have swords here. Look at this. This is very cool. This is very nice. Hello, how are you? Hi, how are you? Oh yeah, you were the one looking for you. <laughs> Metal souls. And here, hello, Jim City Books. Are you an artist on this? I am. Oh, tell me about yourself. Do you have a social media website? If you like to plug yourself, um, it's Graphic Artillery on Instagram. Um, How about so, so, uh, website or anything? Um, mostly everything I do is through my email and Instagram. So okay. Graphic Artillery with uh, it's actually right here. Okay, right over here. Graphic Artillery right over there. Whoops. Okay, and your name is? Ryan. Ryan, so check out Ryan's work. Oh, these are nice. Are they uh, uh, hand, looks like hand, hand drawn? Yeah, they're oh, uh, digital. They're, uh, I'm a mixed medium artist, yeah. so I started as a graffiti artist 27 years ago, so some of it's spray paint, airbrush, watercolor, oh, a little bit of everything. Yeah. Very nice, very cool. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Hello. There's Batman. I think Batman. Okay. Oh, look, here. Here's Deadpool. This is a very cool Deadpool. Way. Oh, that's awesome. And then here is a State, State Farm booth. State Farm. Where, hello. Hello. So you can go here and then they'll print your face onto a comic book cover. Yeah. This is very, very cool. Look at that. Thank you. And then after you get your, your face printed on a comic book cover, so, yeah. It's all custom made. 
It's up to some me. And then after that, you come in, they give you some freebies over here. Now I'm gonna go back to my booth. Let me show you my booth. Okay, so where's my booth? Been away from my booth too long. Uh, so I hope you enjoy this video of Bay Area Comic Con. Uh, my booth is right over here. Right, oh, there's there's Rob Liefeld. Let me go say hi to Rob. Let me see if he's busy. Hey Rob, how are you? Hey, I'm Walden. I don't know if you Walden. know who I am. How are you, buddy? Yes, good to see you. it's a pleasure. I don't know if you know this, but you're, there's a little bit of you that I'm an artist now. Okay. Like you had Extreme Studios from um, we remember yes, you had Extreme yes, Studios, of course. And one of the, one of your uh, inkers, Marlo Equiza. I love Marlo. Yes, yes. He helped me along the way with inking. Awesome. You had an extreme tour. Yes. And then I met Marlo. He gave me uh, one of his business cards. I love it, it had a shaft on it. Uh, okay. His card. And then I kept calling the studio. I kept calling your studio all the time. Did you ever come? I've never. I never oh. came. I, I mean, I wish I could have came. Okay. But then. Like he would tutor me and give me inking critiques. Now, now what, what are you working on right now? Uh, Jinlock for DC Comics. I have mints in my mouth. What? Oh, Jinlock for DC oh, Comics. Good, good. Yeah, and also like uh, Star Wars Dr. Alpha. Okay. Yeah, so I've been be, I've been inking ever since for since 1996. So I've been well, doing it for you. 22 years. Well, congratulations. Yeah, and, and, and it's nice to you. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet good luck you. on the show. I'll be around. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So that's Rob, and here's Ron Mars. Hello, Ron. How are you? I am well, how are you? Good, good. So tell me about yourself, what you're working on, your social media as well. Uh, let's do the social media first, because I'll forget media? that at the end anyway. Okay, okay. Uh, so if you want to find me, find me at Ron Mars on Twitter. Twitter? Um, uh, there's a Facebook page for me, an Instagram page for me too, but I don't check those as often. Um, Let's see, what am I working on? I am the uh, editor-in-chief and lead writer for Ominous Press, which yes. does a bunch of different books. Um, uh, we do Kickstarters, we do art books, we do uh, comics through IDW. Um, so that's kind of a smorgasbord. I'm also, you know, doing writing for other places. Um, uh, Rising Sun from IDW is going to be out in a week or two. That's an adaptation of the, uh, the big Kickstarter board game that yes. uh, came out, which which is a really cool concept. So I was happy to do that. It's a big like samurai epic. Um, and I've got something coming out from, um, let me see, i got a heavy metal story coming out for the Christmas issue. I've got a um, miniseries coming out through Aftershock and some other stuff that hasn't been announced yet. You're busy. Um, yeah, I never I never wonder what to do when I get up in the morning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's very good. That's very good. Look at some of uh, the items that he has here. We've done some work together in the past for DC Comics. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I, I've done, uh, I've been working comics for 23 years already, and I know we've done some work because I, I know your name. We've, and we even communicated through email, I think. I think we crossed yeah. paths, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But this is the first time we've first actually time we met, met in person. person. I had to come across the country to see you. I know, yeah. I'm, I'm close to here. I, I live in San Francisco. Yeah. Yeah, so it's nice to finally yeah, meet thanks, you. Thanks, man. You Thank too. You. Thank you. So I'm going to go back. I'm going to go back to my booth now. My booth is just like a few booths over there. So this is the back of the booth. <laughs> and my daughter is helping me watch the booth right over here. Hello, how are you? So I have original comic book art that I've done. All these are uh, published work for Marvel and DC. Yep. Uh, they're all for sale. All the prices are listed on the top right. Yeah. yeah, and I also have these smaller ones. These are uh, Star Wars uh, projects that I've done for a book called Star Wars Geography. And I also have prints. All the prints are $10 each, buy two, get one free. Yeah, any questions, let me know. So I hope you enjoy this video of Wiz World uh, Bay Area Comic Con. This is the first convention in the Bay Area for Wiz World. And um, follow me on social media for Wall to Wall Art. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. And that's it. That's Wiz World 2019. And this is the bag that I usually out bring to comic book conventions. This bag has my comic book convention essentials. So all the stuff that's in here stays in this bag and then when I need to go to a comic book convention, I'll just bring the bag and then I'll have everything. That way I don't like forget anything. So let's check out what's in here. So here, there's some uh, metallic Sharpies. Here, right over here. I'll, usually I'll bring this and I'll um, sign stuff with. There's also a uh, some pigma liners that I'll bring. So if I need to do uh, uh, commissions, I'll, I'll have these available. Uh, tape, I also have tape, you know, scotch tape, 
always have scotch tape because you know you don't know when you need a lanyard in case I you know need to use this to tie things down or put it around my you know to, to wear stuff for us. Uh, packages of gum, uh, rotate your gum. Okay, I'll bring uh, gum to you to mention. Uh, a pencil box. So this pencil box has all sorts of pencils and markers in there. Also another pack of, let's see, pencils. Another another pack of gums for, you know, because you don't want bad breath in the convention. And let's see what else is there. Let's see what else is in this bag. Also a uh, square card reader. For those that um, wants to use a credit card to buy stuff, let's see what else. Also have these uh, clips, these uh, binder clips. So you know, if I need to uh, clip stuff, at least I'll have it. More, more sharpies in here, right over here. Uh, also business cards. Let me show you my business card. This is a very cool business card. It's like a metallic foil business card. See, look at that. Okay. See. So and then. Oh, probably oh, one of the most valuable things that everyone's into right now is hand sanitizer. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. So because we have the COVID-19, always wash your hands. If you, don't have, if, you don't, if you can't wash your hands, have a hand sanitizer and clean your hands. So until the next video, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share, subscribe. Hit that notification button. Uh, so anytime I upload a new video, you'll be one of the first to uh, see the videos. So until then, take care, stay safe, and stay healthy.